come 2000, the world had really changed and we entered the world of evidence-based medicine and none of these studies could hold up to evidence-based medicine. So that changed both the requirement and the quality of evidence in the field of neuromodulation. And it came to uh, Kemmler and the group headed by Martin Van Cleef uh, to first perform a randomized controlled trial and stimulation. So for spinal cord stimulation, there was one RCT and not mentioned four prospective observational studies, 14 res retrospective observational studies. And so there was grade A evidence and continues to be for spinal cord stimulation for CRPS type 1.